Hey there, how's it going? I'm Eric, and this is my third year doing Extra Life. I'm so excited to be doing it once again and raising money for Johns Hopkins University. They saved my oldest daughter's life twice, and through an affiliated hospital, um, they saved my youngest children's lives when they had to be in a NICU from being born premature. This year, I've got lots of great incentives that I hope will in inspire you to donate money to my Extra Life campaign. Uh, first of all, in a first this year, I'm going to be um, donating, matching donations for the first $100. So for every dollar you put in, I'll also put in a dollar. In addition to that, for every dollar you donate, I'm going to be doing sit-ups or push-ups. One sit-up per dollar. So if you really want to make me suffer, donate lots and lots of money and I'll have to do lots and lots of push-ups. Uh, last year, Dan donated 100 bucks, and I had to do 100 push-ups and boy was I winded at the end of that. This year, I've got a goal of $500, and I'd really, really like to reach it. This is way more than I've ever tried for, but it's really important to me because it really helps a lot. It helps provide lots and lots of um, health care for kids that can't afford it and for, for families that really need it. If we do reach $500, then I'll be coming up with some stretch goals that we can do and see if we can get to 1000 That would be mind-blowing, but if we could do it, think of all the lives you could be helping. Thanks a lot, and enjoy this game. Bye. It's time for Eric Plays Multiplayer Civ. Hey guys, here I am. And uh, once again, getting into Multiplayer Civ, Dan finally played his turns, and we can get to it. Um... I had to launch the game in DX9 mode. I don't remember if that's what I used to do before. So if it looks a little better or worse than usual, that's why. Um, did get a new donation. Um, Discovery point 47. Um, for $25. Thank you so much. That means so much to me. Um, that's my uh, one of my parents' um, um, daycare centers. They have a couple daycare centers in Central Florida um, that... Uh, are pretty huge each has about 200 kids give or take um, so thank you uh, obviously they know um, how much uh, Hopkins has helped their their granddaughter uh, as well as the the twins um, so I guess I've got uh, 25 push-ups or sit-ups to do um, <clears throat> I just started uh, swimming this week for the first time in uh, nearly two years uh, so I think I'll go with sit-ups. I'm a bit a bit tired in my arms, so I'll get uh, that out of the way, and then we'll play uh, play my turns in Civ Five. Now that uh, Dan and Dave are no longer hoarding their turns, so uh, just give me a minute to turn on the light and uh, readjust the camera, and I'll be right back. I know it always seems like I have constant allergies every time I'm recording a game, um, but I did um, cut the grass today, so my, I'm a little more congested than usual. Um, one thing I almost forgot to say is that uh, thanks to um, Dan's donation as well as the donation from my parents, um, I've now raised more money than I've ever raised for Extra Life in any single campaign, which is awesome. Uh, we're also only $125 away from our goal, so... Um, 
we would just need six people at the minimum and we'd be there which is pretty pretty amazing so let's uh, get to the game itself uh, maybe perhaps um, <clears throat> let's see this is five game right so before I was playing the Drex Dex 11 version but apparently some driver issues or something I don't know I really don't care just want to be able to um, you know play the game so we can fire on somebody who's freaking pillaged my farms unfortunately uh, let's come here attack these fools all right next turn they'll probably be dead unless they run away so they just find a territory someone's doing confucius and whatnot okay so that they go waiting for other players so it's been quite some time playing this game it's pretty crazy all right so it's save maybe maybe not I don't know there we go all right Yep, that took this giant multiplayer robots prompting me to submit my turn. I wonder if they've started incorporating Civ 6 games yet or not. Not that we have need of uh, of uh, more, more multiplayer games to play forever and never finish. I don't uh, really remember what's going on in any of these. Um, I do know, for the most part, the only one where we've had any conflict or even met each other is uh, is the one where I think Dan's playing the Turks or something. I'm the Chinese, I think. This one, I think, is one of the ones where I was doing a little better compared to Dan Dave. Alright. Here we go. So, unit needs orders. Alright, so we've got this dude up here in the corner. Don't want to leave my city completely defenseless, so let's bring this guy over here. <clears throat> we'll let this guy heal. And look at this. <laughs> I think that's because I I set the textures to high quality, but um, I didn't want to reboot since the game kept crashing every time I tried to launch in DirectX 11. And I didn't want to try my luck in case 9 was going to start failing. So that's saved. Submit that turn. <laughs> Two more to go, which I think means we're missing one. I thought we were, um, but I could just be a little tired. <laughs> I'm taking quite some time to submit. It's weird. Well, that happens. I'm just gonna continue here. Uh, in Calibra, adding some details to some uh, some ebooks I bought. Oh, there we go. I went through. Of course, it did. Right after I decided to uh, 
the switch over. So we'll load the one now called Tiny Mesa Civ. This is my attempt at uh, making a fast game, but then I forgot to shrink the map. So we're kind of in trouble there. There we go. Is ready for me. Here we go. Dex Coco. Yeah, let's fence those animals in. Um, all right, let's see. Technology done. Wow. Seems ridiculously fast. So they're recommending. Sure, why not? It's only three turns. A road, huh? Well, why don't we construct a mine over there? See if we can stop losing money like crazy. <coughs> and kill these bastards. Nice. Gotta just gotta destroy the natives because I need that money. Gotta get that gold, son. As Hannibal Burr says, money over everything. Okay. Start submitting that turn since last time it took forever. Get to the main menu. Alright, one more game. Okay. Wait a minute. No! I think I picked the wrong one. Unless Dan and Dave were playing this as I was going, but I doubt it. Oh, I see. Okay, good. It's the right one. This is the one where the game is closest to being done. Depending on whether Dan and Dave are teaming up against me or Dan and I are teaming up against Dave. Alright, wow. Florence election shenanigans. Hate shenanigans. Um, I made a proposal, which he has not responded to. Bastard. Um. Guangzhou. Let's get this guy over this way somewhere. I don't even remember what the heck I was doing. Back in city, Florence. Yay. Not exactly rolling in the dough. Let's do a military academy, why not? Worker. I don't know, man. This is why I love Civ 6 and their workers with worker points. I don't know, why don't you just F off. Hey, cool, that helps me with my money issues. Let's get rid of this guy too. Nice. Go home to your family, so you guys have been working forever. Alright, cool, that works. Cannon to left of them, cannon to right of them. Preach, brother, preach. 
All right, and that's that. Let's get this sent off to Dan and Dave. All right. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Well, thank you for watching. This has been Eric playing Civ 5 multiplayer against uh, Dan and Dave. The games that we've had running for, shoot, I think before Scarlet was born. So maybe five or six years at this point. Um, so we'll see where they end up going. And uh, as you can see, we're just uh, 125 short of meeting our goal. So if you want to just drop in a, a, a Benny and a Lincoln, you know, get us uh, towards our goal pretty quickly. Thanks again for watching. Bye.